Okay. Good morning, everybody. Rob here in Bakersfield. Heading out for my first ride since having the shoulder surgery. Getting my left bicep repaired. You might be wondering why am I riding the 2001 custom chrome bar hopper instead of the Sportster. Well, two reasons. Number one, it has a lower center of gravity, so I'm hoping it'd be easier to balance. And number two, it's carbureted instead of fuel injected. And the carburetor needs to get cleaned out. And yeah, I'm running sea foam in the gas tank. So just out for a little cruise to see how my arm does. See how the bike does. Had a little hiccup with the battery, it didn't want to fire up. Had to stick it on the charger again to get it fired. Battery is about two years old. And that's pretty much about all they last around here is about two years. So we'll see how far I'm able to ride before my arm starts to hurt. And I'll have to turn around and go back home. In the meantime, I'm going to have a nice little cruise. So, I'll bounce back and forth, in and out, in case there's anything interesting to say or show you. Otherwise, I'm just going to go ahead and ride and cut this short. I'm not going to just necessarily do a long video of me riding around, but not much to say. Because I'm going to be concentrating on riding and the bike. <laughs> I keep the battery on a battery tender all the time, but even so, the damn things only last about two years. I don't really understand why they can't make better batteries for motorcycles. That's nice. Well, I don't necessarily feel up to lane splitting right now, so <clears throat> I'm not going to. Yeah, let's see, I got BPD behind me there in the left lane. Let's head out on the freeway, blow the carbs out, and hope for the best. Or the carb, not carbs, there's only one.
Okay. Is my arm a little sore after that? Yes, it is. <laughs> I had to go in. Shoulder's okay. It's mostly just the bicep that they had to reattach. So, I guess I'm okay for just like a little riding around, but it's going to take a little longer for riding back and forth to work, lane splitting and all that kind of stuff. <sighs> Damn, she's dirty. I haven't had time to wash all the dust off it. But, whatever. I'm gonna have to check that battery. It's two years old. I may have to just go ahead and replace it. Don't do that. So, thanks for coming along on my first ride since getting the surgery. And that's that. See y'all later. Bye bye. Uh, okay. Just got back from taking the soft tail out for the first ride since having the surgery. Now I'm going to head out on the Sportster. And yes, my arm does hurt a little bit. But what the hell. Took the big one out. Now I'm going to take out the little one. Okay, so sitting here at the light with the bike in gear and the clutch in puts a lot of strain on the muscle in my left arm. I think I'll probably have to kick it out of gear at the stoplights. See, now if I felt 100%, I could just zoom right between them. But I don't feel up to it. Okay, now my shoulder is hurting. That's after riding the soft tail. And now riding the Sportster. And getting down to my exit that leads to work. So it's time to turn around and head home and call it a day. But it's not too bad. I think I could maybe possibly manage it. I don't know. We'll wait to see Monday morning. I do not like all the rumble strips and the damn on-ramps. They want to throw you sideways.
where's that sixth gear at? Oh, that's right, I don't got one. <laughs> so why in the hell doesn't hardly get with the time and put a sixth gear in the Sportster transmission? They really haven't made that many improvements over the last 40 years. I mean, yeah, they've gone to rubber mount engines and they've gone to fuel injection and they've gone to the 1200cc engine. But other than that, the Sportster is still basically the same damn thing it was 40 years ago. You look at all the other bike manufacturers, you look at what Honda, Yamaha, Kawasaki, Suzuki have done over the last 40 years with their bikes. Then I'm just cruising along here at about, oh, 73, 74. I don't know what the RPMs are. Well, it's not straining, but it's not lugging either. But if I had a six gear I could pop this up into, it'd be really nice. Okay, well, Sportster ran just fine, and yes, my arm is sore, so I don't know, might need to wait a little bit longer, we'll see, thank you all for coming along, see you later, bye bye.